here's another level of patience. Once you learn the patterns, the patience kicks in, and the level is not too terribly difficult, although I think I got my ass kicked pretty hard. These guys are a pain in the ass. They were annoying in the previous level because they swan-dived onto your cock, erect or not. In this level, they just kind of float there and wait for you to fuck up, and then they chase you down. And if you turn around to try to swing at them, they run away. So you want to jump up, lure them back, and then dive at them. The sharks are really hard to avoid. You want to wait until they dive down, down thrust them, and then fuck them up. But I did not do that. 90% of the time, they will never be low enough for you to hit with a regular blow. And like pretty much everything in this game, they move way faster than your steroid loaded god see it's very difficult to get away from them but really on the whole this is not a difficult level it's one of those levels that you're able to enjoy the scenery God awful obnoxious fucking place. They're very, very happy to share their semen with you at any possible moment. Very few enemies I've ever seen have been so enthusiastic about shooting their load in your face. Or on your feet if they're unable to get higher. This part's a little more difficult, but only because there are multiple levels, which means that those fish dudes can be more obnoxious, but the boss itself is a joke compared to the previous ones. As long as you have good control of the, the master's in-flight maneuvers, he's it's unlikely that he'll hit you at all. Possible, but unlikely. There's only one move he has that you even need to look out for. And yes, I got my ass kicked enough previously in the last area that I did die here. So this is going off of uh, my second life. Just trying to create some continuity and save people the, the agony of watching me get massacred. Now this guy has a tentacle fetish, but that's okay. Get in there, down thrust a couple of times, wait until that tentacle moves by, or back towards you, and then get out of there, and rinse and repeat. The only thing you need to look out for is that, the little laser shooty thing if you're over there, or when the eyeball itself shoots this giant splooge ball at you and will turn you to stone. But he's easy. I thought he was a mid-tire boss when I first came to him. <laughs> 